He is live at the Clark Sports Center with more. Mike, good evening. Hey there, Steve. That's right, I'm at the Clark Sports Center where the induction will happen in less than two days, Sunday afternoon. As you mentioned before, Ron Santo and Barry Larkin both going in this year. Today, the official start of induction weekend as there was a lot of uh, stuff just going on, activity on Main Street. It's a unique day because you never know just who you might bump into. I always like to talk to the fans because people understand the game. And I understand fans. They wouldn't come to the ballpark unless they were I think a follower of your team, the Cubs, or you as an individual. So I enjoy doing that. I come back every year. I think it's key to what we're doing. You know, I, I think it's, uh, you know, it's imperative that the people support it. We've lost a lot of great players, a lot of the, the foundation of the Hall of Fame. From Hall of Famers like Fergie Jenkins and Raleigh Fingers to other greats like Pete Rose and Lou Piniella, Induction Friday is a chance for fans to meet some of the legends of baseball. I mean, it's kind of wild that you got this many people in town just walking around. You know, there's something that the Hall of Fame, the Baseball Hall of Fame is placed in a place that you got to drive to get up in there because, you know, it ain't easy to get from, from the city. But at the end of the day, once you get here, you know, it's a, you know, you just see that it's a quaint place. The magic of Cooperstown can be felt by anyone who steps onto Main Street and takes that trip down memory lane. It's everything I can imagine, but plus more. And I know my dad has been here a couple times, so he, you know, he really loved this place and talked about it all the time. So when we pulled up, I, I have my two young sons, and like I said, I think for him to have them here and experience it is, is just a real privilege and, you know, memories. It was very emotional for Linda Santo talking to us today. We'll hear more about her father, Ron, as well as Barry Larkin, the two inductees, coming up later tonight at 6 o'clock. Until then, live at the Clark Sports Center in Cooperstown, Mike Levin reporting. Back to you guys. All right, Mike, and yeah, Ron Santo, uh, a lot of Cubs fans thought Ron should have been in uh, many years ago, but he'll get in posthumously. But uh, I think I agree with him, probably should have been in uh, a few years back. So we'll see you again tonight Thanks, at 6.